Hey guys, it is Buster72, and welcome back to another video on the channel. So, last video I said I would do a video, the next video would be a money making guide on how to make money. This is personally how I made a bunch of money, um, really quickly, because uh, I was a, I did buy a gold sword. I also bought a gold pickaxe. That's why I have two of them, because I crafted one for the quest and crafted one, um, or bought one. Um, this is how I made a bunch of money really quick. Uh, I had 100,000 within the first day of doing this method, and then it just goes exponential from there. Um, this is the method that worked for me. Um, this is probably not the best method. There's probably other methods out there that are way better, but this is the method that worked for me. So first, what I'd recommend is get yourself some wheat seeds, like literally just one or two wheat seeds, and go ahead and just plant them, um, and wait for them to grow. And harvest, plant, harvest, plant, harvest, rinse, and repeat. Um, it is going to be really tedious, but like, uh, no one said making money was hard in this game, or easy in this game. Um, if you do have the ability to AFK overnight, I would highly recommend buying yourself one of these hatchlings, um, underlings. I don't know why I call them hatchlings. Close enough. All right, I recommend buying one of these, at least one underling, um, and just AFKing and letting him harvest for you. Um, Obviously, the more underlings you can get, the better, but they are expensive. I want to say they're at 25k each, or 15k, I'm not quite sure, um, but they are expensive. So anyways, you want to keep on doing this. When you have enough money, buy more wheat for a wheat field, and just keep on doing it. Until you get about 200 wheat seeds, then that's probably about enough. And at that point, what you can do is, every 1,000 wheat is 3k. So I have 53,000 here, so what does that work out to? Like 100... 59k ish, I think, if I did my math right. So, anyways, once you get enough wheat, go ahead to the marketplace. Go to Maya at spawn. I'll show you that. So, come on over here to. Oh, Mula's. I don't know why I said. My, oh, Maya's a blacksmith. Alright, come over to Mula. Um, so, yeah, switch, hit, switch to sell. Select your. If I can find it, wheat. Um, you can only send, sell a thousand at a time, um, but yeah, just sell it, and then once you have enough, go, uh, put, switch to buy, and then buy a watermelon seed. Um, you may only get one at a time, which is totally fine, um, but just keep buying the watermelon seeds and start planting them. So watermelon is going to take longer to grow than wheat, so grow watermelon in like at the same time as you're growing wheat um and off and also like when you're harvesting there's a small chance that you'll get two seeds instead of just one back so that also helps um a little bit but again grow watermelon with wheat since watermelon takes so much longer than wheat to grow i don't even know if it'll grow by the time i end this video i'm going to try to plant some watermelon to show you guys just how long this takes to grow so watermelon and wheat we'll plant the watermelon first and we'll plant the wheat um, and you'll see this is going to take absolutely forever to grow. Um, and once you get to about... Don't worry about this. <laughs> this is about 400 watermelon seeds. But anyways, just keep on buying more watermelons. Uh, watermelons sell for 390 I think? Or 190 each, I think? I'm not quite sure. Um, but just keep on buying watermelon seeds until finally you get enough. Uh, right here is about 400 watermelon seeds. I'll... Here, I'll harvest them all, and I'll show you guys how much I get per harvest. Alright, there, so that harvest, what did I get? I got 457 watermelons. Um, I just remember about 400 because I just get more seeds every single time. And as you can see right here, this thing is still not done growing, and this wheat's already done growing, so that's why I grow them in tandem. And here, I'll show you guys how much I get if I sell a harvest. So when it comes to selling, you can sell any one of these guys. Uh, well, sell to the hatch underlings. I keep on saying hatchlings! Sell to the underling dude. Um, here we go. Oh, they sell for 380 each. Holy cow. Come on. It's a little annoying how you can overshoot so easily. There we go, 457. What do we get there? Oh, like 80k? Just like from 
one harvest, which is crazy, I think. Um, that can, like, that's not quite enough for the gold sword as I was talking about last video. But, like, still, that's, like, the best way to get money. You just harvest that, and you keep going. And you just harvest, keep going. So, for the, just in quick recap, best way, get yourself wheat. Buy as much wheat as you can until you get to about 200 wheat. And then harvest the wheat and start buying watermelon seeds. If you are a bit able to AFK overnight, then go ahead and buy yourself as many hatchlings as you can place down. If you are unable to AFK overnight, just continue buying wheat um, until you're able to until you get to 200. Once you get to 200, or you can even do 150. Once you get to like 200, 150, then you start buying watermelon seeds. Plant those along with planting wheat. Um, and then just keep buying more and more watermelon seeds until eventually you just get a bunch of watermelon. But anyways guys, hopefully this guide is helpful to you on making money in this game. Um, not like money does a whole bunch in this game, but you know, sometimes it's just nice to be super rich and brag about it. Um, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. Hope you guys enjoyed. And